welcome to another episode of Mike's Garage. So I have another good one for you today. So as you know, I've had a few different vendors reach out to me and say, hey, try my product. So I've got another one here. So this one is Top Don is the company. And basically it's the BT100 battery tester. So let me kind of zoom in a little bit so you can see it. Now I haven't used this before, so I'm just essentially opening it up and giving it a shot. See if it works. Now, I've used uh, uh, many different battery testers over the years. My favorite is the old school one that has a big old resistor in it. It's a big uh, metal box, if you will, and it's got the clamps on it, and that always worked really well. Anyway, so let me uh, pull this out, and we will give it some tests. All right, so looking at this, it's saying it's at 12.54 uh, uh, volts. It's a little bit different from what my multimeter read. So I'm gonna go through this and let's see if I can figure it out. So it looks like it's pretty intuitive as far as the menu on it. So let me press enter. We'll do battery test. So let me do that. Looks like you could do cranking and charging test as well. So that's kind of neat. Press enter, choose your battery type. Okay. Um, Looks like you could select the input of how you want to do it. So let me go to cold cranking, cold cranking apps. Here we go. And let me adjust this to what it should be. So, all right, got it set. And I'm gonna press enter. So now it is testing. So let's see what it comes up with. We'll uh, look at the results at the same time. And that's what it is saying. All right, so it says battery, not bad. It's not bad. All right, so, but essentially it's pretty cool, uh, pretty intuitive, so you can go through and essentially Check your charging system, check your battery, um, cranking tests, you name it. So kind of neat. Looks like you could change the language as well, and it's got some additional information. So um, yeah, overall, uh, pretty neat. I'd probably want to grab a different uh, battery tester as well and maybe compare the two. That 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 would be probably a more, uh, a, a better way to test it, if you will, but you know, for, uh, for, I think it's around 50, 60 bucks or whatever that this might cost, it's a pretty good deal. So once again, thank you for watching Mike's Garage.